Hey guys, it's me, Cruel, back again with another animation video on this channel, and today I'll be watching reacting to Aping's 5. This has been a song that has been sitting towards the top of my request list for a good while now, and finally I'm getting to it. Uh, so yeah, the highest requested Aping song that I have not reacted to yet. I have reacted to a lot of Aping dolls, so if you're interested in the other versions, there's all of them in the playlist in a pinned comment. Other than that, if you're new to the channel, hi guys and Cruel, I reach to K-pop every single day, and also check out all kinds of comebacks, so... If you want to see more, just check out my channel and go into the video tab or in the playlist tab. I do have a playlist for every artist I've reacted to. Now, also a quick shout out to my Patreon lineup of September. Thank you so much for the continuous support. And special shout out goes out to Fodita Yatna, Misubins, and Reese Roller. Thank you guys. And here we go with Apex 5. We also have a member overview. I guess we can quickly look at that. Um, so you guys kind of know what it is. Maybe you need it as well. I don't know where you're standing at as a... A pink panda or just a pink fan no matter where you're at like which type of fan you are um fan or stan you know but yeah bomi with short uh kind of like blonde hair then we have hyung with dark or like i would say even black hair right and then we have Choron with red we have Nawan with kind of a red color as well like like a red brown right and then namjo is like a brown gray whereas unji is straight up dark brown so they all have kind of similar uh not similar kind of different hair colors so i hope that works and hope that helps me a bit now let's begin with the music video though and if you, you know, want me to react to anything else epic related just group music videos or solos or something like that that i have not checked out yet then let me know in the comments here we go i think that was now in right beginning which would make sense Actually, one thing I have to say before we begin, funnily enough, yesterday, uh, by the time I'm recording this, today's the 17th, yesterday I read the news on um, Aping's company, PlayM Entertainment, uh, they're actually gonna merge soon, at least, not yet, but merge with Cracker Entertainment, um, and Cracker Entertainment only has one group, and that's the boys, so the boys will be kind of integrated into the PlayM groups, which is, of course, Aping, Weekly, uh, Victon, and so on, so... Um, it's gonna be interesting to see what that does to Victon in particular, you know, because the boys obviously is much much bigger than Victon. Not true. And also, I'm wondering what their name is gonna be as a company because I feel like they, from what I've read in this statement, they're actually gonna rename as well. By the way, they're both Kakao Entertainment subsidiary subsidiaries anyway, so it doesn't really change much other than them becoming one company and maybe moving into one building. Who knows? Okay. Bumi. <laughs> hey, Unji. I love you, girl. Oh, this is now on, huh? Hey, the, the yellow nails, I like it. Oh. Very high key. They're singing in. By the way, what are they doing? Are they like kind of playing Monopoly? <laughs> Cute. They're all visuals, man. That's wild. Whoa. Good noun. Wow. Is this now or is this Namju? I actually don't know. I actually don't know who this I think this is more Namju. Uh, is it? I don't the hair actually makes me think it's more noun hairline. Yeah, I think I think this is noun that we just saw, yeah. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Gardening, okay. So they, they roll in what they do. <laughs> There's some Namju. You go, girl. One, two, three, four, five. Kinda catchy. One, two, three, five. Wow, her earrings. You go, Churong. Oh, Namju with high note. Let's go, Namju. Oh, there's OG. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I just noticed the instrumental as well. It's super, super like old school. Almost retro, like 80s. I wish I could. <laughs> I would. And they roll a five, of course. <laughs> that was so cute. So they kind of, I mean, they ran around in, in that... Uh, What's English word? Oh my god, I actually don't know. I don't know what's the English word for that. <laughs> Wait, that's really embarrassing. Why do I not know? Squ oh my god, square. I didn't know square. Okay, my bad. Just anyway. Uh, they're running around in the square and they kind of play Monopoly, but they always roll on what they actually do next in the music video as a concept, right? They had gardening and so on before that. And honestly, I found that really cute. Uh, we had flowers before that, something. I don't even remember all of the concepts, but they rolled the concepts. I only realized that actually with the gardening, where I read the card as well that they rolled and stuff. Um, and yeah, and I think this, even though this is a June upload, right? Is this even a song from June? Let me, let me see the beginning. Yeah, it is. So this actually was uploaded in June. So this is like already kind of summer, right? This is not at all a summer song. This feels like an actual spring song, like super, super spring song, which is, I would say, kind of rare. Um, it's not many concepts like these in K-pop, I feel like. And if anything, this reminds me of what sometimes G-Friend used to do, um, you know, like with Rough, maybe, maybe with uh, Glass Bed, something like that. Kind of like a G-Friend vibe a little bit. But I don't really see any other concept or like group that that uh, did similar concepts to this, so um, something that is not done that often, and I, I really enjoyed the vibe of this song, because, again, it felt like a spring song to me, not just visually, especially visually, of course, but also the sound of it, it's super, super reminding me of spring, and, like, this fresh breeze, and, like, flowers blooming, and everything like that, right, and I really, really enjoyed that, it was so pretty, um, actually, it's super catchy, too, and some great high notes from Namju into Unji, I love that both of them had that. Like it was kind of like a, um, you know, part one, part two. So it wasn't just Unji who, like a lot of the time in their songs, is the one that is responsible for these high notes. But no, and uh, not even high notes. It's kind of almost a belting that they do, right? Especially Unji. But um, I really like that they have both of them doing that here. I remember checking out an Aping song. I forgot which title that was, but there was one. I think that was like. A, they were dancing in in a in a park or something in front of a fountain, and like in between a uh, like a door or something a garden door, and I remember Namju I think or like at least someone having blonde hair too, but uh, not Namju Namju blonde hair was in Dum Dum Um anyway Namju also had like great high notes in that song that's the only other one I remember. Uh, other than that I don't think she really had them yet in the songs I know from them at least. Anyway I really like uh, five so really. Really happy I checked this out and I can, you know, add this to my playlist because that's absolutely gonna happen. I uh, really enjoyed it. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. Thank you so much as well to all of the Pink Panda for requesting this back in the day. You know, I, I used to, um, I guess, react to A-Pink a bit more. And then I got requests for a lot of A-Pink songs. But most of them that are or were requested often I have reacted to now 
There's one or two uh, I have not reacted to, but they were also not requested very often, so they're kind of more down uh, on the list. If there's anything I have not reacted to and you want me to, though, let me know, and uh, yeah. Have a nice day. See you next one. Peace.